today is a good day because I'm going to go and see my friend who lives kind of far away, maybe like an hour's drive. But I thought I would set up my car mount and take you along with me because see when I moved to Vancouver, wait, what's that? Soon when I move to Vancouver, I'm not gonna have a car to drive. I'm gonna pop into Starbucks on my way. Because I feel like I should do a drive through if I'm gonna do a drive with me. I'm doing drive through and I really fancy a drink because I did a workout this morning and I feel like I haven't hydrated myself properly. I feel like I found a nicer chai latte than Starbucks. I know it's controversial, but I really have. My friend has a one-year-old. Oh my god, she's so cute. So I'm gonna see her and say hello to her and keep spending time with her. The last time I saw her, honestly, she did not like me at all. She just spent the whole time crying. I think it's because she was born in lockdown and she hasn't seen that many people. I don't think I'm that scary. At least I hope I'm not scary, but maybe I am. I don't really know. Excuse me, why are you driving me so slow? Okay, this is really driving me nuts here. I'm overtaking you. I bet you he speeds up now. Because this whole time my phone been in the in the shop. Oh well. Sorry guys. Here is the drive through. It's the drive through. It's the drive through. I've only been through the drive through like once in McDonald's, once in Starbucks. That's it. And then Starbucks time, oh my god, I was so stressed. And then I missed where the order point was. So this time I can't miss where the order point is because that would be extremely Bad. Just not miss it, not miss it, not miss it. Order here. There's a big sign. I don't know how I missed it last time. Welcome to Starbucks. What can I get for you? Hi, can I get a tall iced chai tea latte with almond milk, please? That's it, thank you. Thank you. Can I have a straw, please? Thank you so much. She was not having a very good day. I had to ask for a straw because when I'm driving, I can't like be tipping the sippy cup up because I'm gonna spill it everywhere. Hi, I've arrived. I didn't get to drink. Wait, my hair is wrong. I didn't get to drink any of my chai latte because I really need to pee. <gasps> Now that I'm here, I can pee and I can drink the rest of it. But it still tastes good actually. An hour and a half later and it still tastes good. This hair is going weird. Anyway, I'm gonna go in now. It's now five, almost six o'clock. I'm going to see my parents now. So I'm just heading back in the car. It was so nice to see her, honestly. For once, her little, wait, I need to concentrate. Her little girl was so happy about me. To begin with, she was a bit nervous. So I feel like I'm making progress. I'm also so sad that I'm going to be going to Vancouver and then I'm going to go to see her and I'm going to go to see my friend. I'm just so sad. Just the right way. I don't get this song. It's just so repetitive. She only has like two lyrics or like one sentence she says over and over again. But it's really popular at the moment, I think. Make me feel good, make me feel nice. Make me feel good all through the night. Feel nice, make me feel good all through the night. It's honestly the weirdest song I've ever heard. I just don't understand that. Can you be quiet? heard it on the radio on this journey down and back literally at least three times in today <laughs> make me feel good make me feel nice hi editing michaela here excuse the mess in the background we're currently in a state of packing for vancouver this vlog was initially meant to be just my leaving parties but i had some other footage that i didn't include in another vlog that i just thought you know what i'll just tag it on here so that footage was from the week before and now i'm going to go on to kind of the leaving parties section which are quite spread out over a couple of weeks so the footage kind of moves around a lot in terms of time it probably doesn't make a difference to you but in case you wondered or thought why is the time flowing so weirdly that is why probably didn't need to explain that so let's just get back to the video hi friends this is a very exciting vlog because over the next couple of weeks i'm having a lot of leaving parties and saying goodbye to people before we head to vancouver and i thought i would bring you along for the goodbyes oh no God, we're not, you can't say goodbye my mum says you can't say goodbye because it's not goodbye it's just good luck and it's not a party because it's not a happy thing. We're gonna call it a leaving, a leaving? A leaving gathering. So I'm just getting ready and I'm going to my parents' house where we're gonna have our family leaving. Le Why do I keep saying leaving? Our family leaving gathering. It's, 
like an afternoon thing so we're gonna have a buffet uh, like a buffet buffet food and i actually don't know why i haven't even got a mirror here so i'm just trying to use the viewfinder but i actually can't see what i'm doing i went to the hygienist this morning to the dentist and got my teeth all clean so they're all sparkling but also a little bit sore because honestly I feel like she's just attacked my entire gums and my teeth are gonna fall out cost me 89 pounds though 89 pounds bloody hell i mean you can't put a price on good teeth am i right or am i right but 89 pounds is absolutely extortionate it's absolutely extortionate imagine if you actually were a hygienist right and you got all of the profits you didn't have to pay it was your own company and you paid you got paid 89 pounds for 45 minutes and you did however many in that day You'd be raking it in. I should have been a dentist. When I was younger, I wanted to be a dentist by day and then an actress by night. I don't really know how that would have worked, but anyway. We are approximately one hour behind schedule. I said to her I would be there at 11 and it is 11. What's the time? 11.03. Oh dear. Right, let's go. Got everything and you lock the door. Well, here's a bit of clutch control. Oh, not quite. A bit of slippage. A bit of slippage. That's what makes you beautiful. Na, 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 na. It's the song again. Make you feel good all through the night. You'd hate the song. It really is. It's just got nothing for going for it. How is this the music of today? just the same squeeze because we need to pick up some stuff for the party no I keep calling it a party oh my god i cannot call it a party i don't know how much i'm gonna film actually in the gathering got it right that time because it's about all my family i want to spend time with them also like they don't want to be in my vlog so i will just show you some bits but probably not masses but just know we're having a great time drinking laughing eating what everything's all about oh my god i was just talking to myself well i was just talking to the camera and then someone just Pie. So oh my god, I'm gonna have to turn the car on because I'm absolutely sweltering. Uh... It's party time. It's not party time. Why don't you say that? It's gathering time. It's gathering time. You're so tall, I have to hold it up so high. <laughs> because today is my last day of work <laughs> oh my god i can't believe that that and the fact that i'm moving to vancouver in like two weeks time <laughs> last night i was having a bit of a freak out i was like oh my god what am i doing i'm gonna have no job i'm going to vancouver i'm gonna be unemployed i'm gonna have no money and i'm leaving a nice job that pays me well <sighs> it's okay i'm keeping my attitude positive this morning even though inside i'm slightly freaking and dying oh my god it's so hot it's so sunny in this location i'm in right now which is great for lighting but not so great when you're in a jumper i have to go into the office to hand in my laptop so i'm going to be getting the train and going there in a second bringing my laptop bringing my security files handing it all in and saying bye bye strange oh my god i'm just gonna go to the post office because i have a parcel to post and then i'm gonna go home <laughs> i finished a bit early because they were being nice and um, i had nothing else to do so i was just sitting there so that's it <laughs> oh my god it was so weird hello vlog <laughs> i'm back home from work and i just had a tea and then was relaxing and i just got changed 
into something a bit nicer for the evening. Not that we're doing anything that crazy. We're just having a nice dinner here. And pop in the champers. <laughs> Funny story about this champagne. Hello. Funny story about the champagne is we got the champagne when we bought our flat that we currently live in and we were meant to use it for celebrating this flat but then we didn't and then we thought we were going to save it for when we bought a house but now we're not buying a house because we're moving to Vancouver! <laughs> Did I mention? And I just quit my job, I just quit my job and I'm moving to Vancouver! I feel in a really, really strange mood. I feel sad, I feel excited, I feel terrified, I feel scared, I feel happy, I feel hyper. Am I gonna be able to do this? Oh, oh, jeez Louise. Oh, that made a really unsatisfying noise. Do it again, do it again. I mean, it was good. If I was a rest job person, that's really good because yeah. I feel like people will be like, it needs to be silent when you're in a restaurant. Yeah, isn't that really stressful, eh? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> good, good, good. We've got it in two different glasses because I like this glass and you like this glass. Cheers. Cheers. Delicious. Really? Yeah. I need another sip. Very champagne y. Oh, it really warms my heart. I know. Why does champagne make your throat burn so much? But Prosecco doesn't. Mm. What is it about champagne? Can someone tell me the science behind this? Because I need to know. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, what am I doing with my life? Interruption from me again. These weird noises <laughs> happened all night, have been happening for weeks. I just randomly will go, <gasps> but I think about the enormity of what's going on and I freak out and then I'm like, okay, again, and I just carry on as normal very weird but we're just gonna roll with it <laughs> Hello. it's a beautiful day later on today we've got our leaving drinks with all my friends so I'm really excited for that I've just taken Pete to a scan and I'm just going off to find some food because I'm really hungry and this scan's gonna take like an hour Oh my god, it's really noisy. <laughs> so I think I might take myself to Peace Express <laughs> for myself. I do use one, but hey ho. I would have put makeup on if I thought I was going to do that, but I'm actually really hungry and think that I need to eat it. I didn't bring my vlogging camera because I didn't think I was going to vlog, and then I just decided, you know, I'm not going to vlog. I just felt like it. <laughs> I'm just using my phone, so apologies for the quality. I'm back from my lunch day. Are you proud? I went all in lunch from all by myself. There was there was this couple next to me. Well, not a couple. Like a, looked like a mother and a daughter. I was like, the, felt really sorry for the mum because the daughter was just being so mean. So uh, the daughter must have been like I don't know, like. 50s or 40s and then the mum was older than that so first of all she the, the mum obviously said something and then the daughter was like no i've told you before they don't put your details on the receipt the, that's the receipt they've just given you to pay you obviously your details aren't on there i've told you this before and then the the, the mum was like but it, it doesn't matter and then she was like it does matter because i've told you before <laughs> so then that happened and then all of a sudden the mum said I can't remember what happened. Next, when they got up and they were about to leave, and she was like, Where's your gloves? And then um, she said, She was like, Showed her something. She said, No, your gloves. <laughs> and then I could see them on the floor behind, and I was like, Do I see anything? I'm kind of scared. And then they carried on, and the, the mum was going, I don't know, I don't know. And then I just said to the, the, the daughter, Oh, um, I, I think it's on the floor. And then the mum, as that did that, stepped, stood back onto them, and then the daughter was saying, you're on them now! You're on them! Come off of them! Come forward! And she was really shouting, like right in the middle of the Pete's Express. And I just felt so sorry. Oh, I was just so sad. If you're gonna be mean, you shouldn't go to lunch with them. <laughs> uh, anyway, that was my interesting story. Hi! It's a lot later. As you can see, I look a lot better than I did earlier. So I'm all ready for our leaving drink. We're just gonna head off into London now. Um, we're going to Slug and Lettuce, which is like a cocktail bar and then do like happy hour and stuff anyway you want to see my outfit i feel like i'm trying i feel like i look like i'm trying to be cool can you even see no okay there's like these clock things 
But they've got this lacy material here and then these the manages. We were meant to get there at 7, but one of my friends is already in London and she was like, oh, do you want to meet up before? So we might get there, we're going to get there earlier and then see her for a bit, which would be nice to chill and talk to her before it gets a bit more crazy. I don't know why, I just feel nervous that people aren't going to come. Well, I hate doing parties or like things like this just because I feel nervous. And like people have, people couldn't, some people couldn't come because they were busy and then some people couldn't come because of Covid. And I just get nervous that then no one's going to turn up. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate organising stuff. I hate being... I don't know, I just hate it. But I'm sure it'll be fine and we'll have a good time.